What's going on? What's going on? It's your boy, Tell We Loaded. I'm going to be Jada. Wait, I 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 Every other day or every single day, like if it's Monday, I'ma drop on Wednesday. If it's Wednesday, I'ma drop on Friday. If it's Friday, I'ma drop on Sunday. I don't know. A motherfucking updated Q and A. I think the last time I did something like an updated Q and A or some shit, it was like six months ago or something. But it's six months past. Shit changed, so I'm just like, let's let me do a. Updated Q&A with you. I'm not gonna do too much talking. Let's get into the video. The first question I got here is how old are you? I am 21 years old and I will be turning 22 this Well, not this month August 2nd How old is the baby? The baby is six months. Saya is six months. I'm actually outside of his house right now I want to go see him, but I think everybody in the house sleeps months. What inspired you to to come up with Tamiya? What inspired me to come up with Tamiya? To be honest with you I used to do like girls be like but like I used to do like ghetto accent. I used to be like doing the ghetto accent and stuff, but like I kinda stopped cause I see I see like I stopped cause I was like so young and I was so caring about other what other people had to say. And I'm like it's comedy. I, I used to try to um be I used to look off the other comedians, I forgot their name because some of them actually stopped. But one person I used to look at was um, Blame It On K-Way and I'm like, I could do these characters too. I could make it, I could make it funny because the well, in my city, it's like so many females out here that act a certain way. So I'm just like, I could do this. Like I could show y'all, I could, I could repeat this. I'm just like, let me show y'all how girls be like for real. Like some of y'all don't really know how girls be like for real. So I'm like, let me show y'all how girls be like, you feel me? So I just did it. It's not, I didn't do to be just to do it or just cause I wanna be, act like a girl, like some of y'all stupid ass be saying. But I just did to be a, to like add on to my, to my crap. Next question is, um, when, when you coming to Temple? When am I coming to Temple? I don't know when I'm gonna come to Temple to be honest with you. I'm not even gonna sit here and try to hold y'all. Hold on, let me fix the camera. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. <laughs> Do you got a girlfriend? Hell nah, your boy is single, dingo, lingo, 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 single, lingo, lingo, single, single, single. You trying to put me down to somebody? I'm looking. A new song, Broke Ass, coming this Friday. You feel me? Broke Ass will be dropping this Friday at. I don't know what time, but Broke It. Broke Ass will be dropping this Friday. That's my next song. Broke Ass. You feel me? Um. Is your real name Terry? Is my real name Terry? Is my real name Terry? I don't know, man. It's just my real name Terry. It's my real name Terry. No. Um, it is my name, but that's like a nickname. You feel me? I don't. Y'all not. Um, y'all so federal. Like, why the fuck? Why the why? Why well, I'm finna sit up here and tell y'all my real name? I'm not telling you that. Four. Um, do you plan on dating? Do I plan on dating? I actually do plan on dating because like to be honest with you, I'm not gonna lie I'm getting to an age. I'm about to be 22. I want a girlfriend. I want to settle down with a girl I want to be like you feel me. I just want I just want that relationship shit But like it's I always tend to run into the wrong person. It's either I find somebody And she fucking with somebody on the low. It's either I find somebody She ghosts me. It's either I find somebody. It's just always something y'all. It's always something I'll be trying I really be trying, but it's always something. Where did you get the name Tabinia? The name Tabinia came from. Damn, they be just just talking. The name Tabinia came from my name, T, as in Terry, and then I got an older sister named Bensi. I put, cause like when I do Tabinia, I got the um Ben from. My sister Bensi. So Terry, as in T, 
been yeah and then the yeah it's a funny story my dad was actually gonna name my sister ella benia so i took t ben yeah terry ben and then my sister's almost name ella benia so we collided it together and i made t benia um all right the next question are you gay? What made you start the Tabinia skits? If you are, who cares? Love your content. No, I am not gay. I answered this multiple times. Y'all, I'm not gay. Tabinia is just a made up character to make people laugh. Tabinia is nothing serious. I understand why I asked that, because I'm not gonna lie, I kind of go overboard with it. I understand why I asked. But no, y'all, I am not gay. I'm not gay. She acts respectfully, so I'm going to answer her respectfully. No, no. If there's one celeb you would want to meet, who would it be and why? I mean, Cardi B. Right there, yeah. Cardi B as a female celebrity that I want to meet. I want to meet Cardi B because she is funny as hell, talented as hell. I want to meet Cardi B. And a male celebrity that I would want to meet and why I say this is hard. Um, I'll say Lil Durk. That nigga, that's my favorite fucking rapper. That's one of my favorite rappers. Him, Future, um, Lil Baby, Drake. I would want to meet all of them. They just start doing skits. I'm just always a character. Like, I like acting. Like, I'm an actor. Like, I love acting. I love acting out shit that I feel like, oh, I could do that way better. Like, I just love acting and I love making people laugh. You coming to the when you come to Brooklyn? I don't know yet. How does uh, what is a jit or a j what is a jit? All right, jit means in Broward like what you doing jit? Tighten up jit. Like jit and Broward mean like I don't know. It just means jit. Like you a jit? Like a person? Like what you doing jit? I don't know if I'm wrong. I mean, if you and Broward do not fucking judge me. Cause I know that's what it means. What you doing, Jit? Like something is just like a playful word. Like what you doing, Jit? Stop playing with me, Jit. Or it's just like you a little, you a little bud. Like you a Jit. What's your body count? Oh, bitch. Y'all really wanna know my body count? Do y'all really wanna know my body count? Cause y'all ask me this all the time. Y'all really wanna know my body count? Do y'all really wanna know my body count? Y'all really, really, really wanna know my body count? Do you really, really, really wanna know? None of your fucking business. That's my body count. I love you, but none of your business. What advice do you have for small influencers? Ooh, don't put on the front. Don't act like something you not. Come on the internet. Act like you have sense and be you. And fuck the comments. Fuck the haters. Because you always going to have haters regardless. Because if you don't got no haters, you ain't doing shit. So at the end of the day, keep doing you. Be you. Don't try to be the next person. Be you. If you Tom, be Tom. If you Jazz, be Jazz. Be you. Being an influencer. The person being an influencer. Let me see. What's the perks of being an influencer? Um, like perks as in like good shit. Alright, um, the perks of being an influencer is like you got good people supporting you to be to me. Like you got really good ass supporters and I really fuck with them. And a lot of people just your face is gated, basically. <laughs> What have you learned throughout the journey of success? First of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, first of all. I love how y'all think so highly of me, but y'all don't know the definition of like made it or success. Like I am like, okay, I do appreciate everything that I've succeeded so far, but there's way more y'all. There's hella shit along the lines that I gotta succeeding like there's so much shit i hate when people tell me you made it because this is not made it like i stand on being humbled and for me to sit up here on the internet and be like oh nigga i made it yeah bitch i made it bitch i made it bitch i'm him i made it you did not make it you feel me that's just me being real like you did not make it that's just me being real to myself me telling myself that I made it is gonna make me slack. I did not make nothing. I didn't make nothing. I succeeded in some things. And your question, to answer your question, I actually feel good about the things that I succeeded so far. Cause there's hella more that I gotta succeed before this year ends. And hella more that I gotta succeed. Hell of more. And we got many years to go. 
and I'm and I'm so appreciative of y'all. Thank you so much. But one, um, how do your parents and family feel about your videos? <sighs> uh, they support me. They really do. They actually support me. Like they support me with it. But when I tell you when Jada Wada came out. I started seeing a shift. I started seeing a shift. Y'all, y'all, my reloaded gang, y'all family. So I'ma tell y'all, I don't give a freak who's watching this video. I don't care. Y'all watching this family? You watching this? I'ma tell y'all how I feel. Like, let's get into. Like, I started feeling like a shift. Like, yeah, everybody mess with it, but like, it's like some people in the family they've heard the song. They don't say nothing to me. They don't say a congratulations. Some people just go straight to judging me. Oh, that's so ghetto. Cause you know we those. Oh, all that cursing. Or oh, they don't even. They like hide the fact that they got the video got so successful. They hide the fact that the video is doing what it's doing, and they just jump straight to judging me. Like oh, that's so ghetto. Oh, all this cursing. And it's like some people who realize it. I got so many family members telling me, oh, good job on your video. Congratulations on your video. Nobody in my household but my sister and my cousin, my one cousin, congratulated me about that video. And I don't care how nobody feels. That's just me. I'm just going to talk my life. I'm going to tell them. Like, if you're watching this, I don't care. Y'all probably going to confront me. Why are you telling it? I don't care. I'm going to tell them. Nobody in my household but my sister and my one cousin congratulate me i got people walking on my nose walking up and down and see me every day and see y'all follow me on social media don't know what i'm saying i don't need your congratulations but it's just like the courtesy you feel me it's like dang like you see something like you can't say congratulations or something that's a big milestone like you feel me but how the family feels about the video they mess with it but i think if i continue this music journey like trying to do music for fun like i'm not a real artist now if I continue this music journey, they're gonna have a problem. Cause I am a grown I'm so sorry to whoever's watching this and you family. I'm a grown man. I'm getting into a place where like I don't need nobody's validation or opinion on what I do. Cause I'm gonna do whatever I want regardless. Because I know what I do, I put God before everything. So I don't need nobody judging me. And you don't gotta say congratulations to me at all. You don't got to talk to me. You don't got to do none of that. Anyways, next question. Would you fly to Cali to fuck with a girl? It depends if I'm really like, if I've really been vibing with you, been talking for months. I'm not going to fly down to you in, within a week. Hell no. If I've been talking to her for like a month or so, hell yeah, I'm going to fly down. If I actually fuck with her, I'm going to fly down. Next question is, do you have any new music coming out? Broke ass is coming out broke ass um what's your middle what's your middle name my middle name is get money <laughs> uh, have you ever tried to kiss someone and they slapped you no what's your favorite designer brand my favorite designer brand i think i'll say louis vuitton even though i don't owe not a damn piece of louis vuitton my favorite designer brand gotta be louis vuitton like i don't owe a piece of designer i don't owe a piece of louis vuitton but that's my favorite designer brand will you see will, will we see you in any movies or tv shows in the future most definitely will what's today's date monday june 27th Rem monday june 27th 2022 remember i said this by next year Y'all will see me on a TV show. I don't care what it is. I'm putting that in the air. By next year, I will be on a TV show in the name of Jesus. I will be on someone's movie screen. I don't know when, but trust me. This face is gonna is not only for YouTube. It's going to be for the big screens and TV. So, yes, I will be. That's the plan. I hope so. Whoever is watching this and is a casting director, hit me up. How do you feel about the new Long Florida about getting put over loud music? Are you dumb? Cause I was just playing loud music. Pull me over, bitch. Pull me over, man. Are you still friends with Destiny? Duh, I'm still friends with Destiny. That's my sister, you feel me? Hell yeah, I'm still friends with Destiny. Would you date your best friend, Liberty? No, her crazy ass. Hell nah, I would not date Liberty. Hell nah, hell nah, hell nah. 
What was your first job? This lame ass, broke ass job named Extreme Action Park down in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Were you born in Haiti? No, I was not born in Haiti. I was born in Broward County, Florida. Which wig do you like the most? I like the orange bob wig. I don't know why, but I fuck with the orange bob. Like that shit just like, it's just like, I don't know. It's just ordinary. I fuck with it so hard. Um, when are you going to get a girlfriend? Shit, I don't know. I don't know when I'm gonna get a girlfriend. Everything, every time I think I'm about to get one, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, y'all, so that's it, you feel me? That's it, really. I hope I didn't offend nobody in this video. I just spoke truth of how I feel. I appreciate my supporters for supporting me and everything that I do. I fuck with y'all, I love y'all. We litty. That being said, it's your voice, Harry Loaded, and I'm signing out. See y'all in the next video. I said, it's your boy Harry Loaded, and I'm signing out. I'm gonna fuck with y'all later. See y'all in the next video.